there, and welcome to the exciting world of HIP. Good morning. I'm Andrea Jackson with your Wake Up Call for Thursday, February 10th, 2011. A U.S. tanker carrying $200 million worth of oil was hijacked by a band of Somali pirates, one of their biggest jobs yet. Oil companies here in the U.S. are using new drilling tactics to release natural gas from shale rock, reversing a 20-year decline in the crude oil biz. Meanwhile, back at the Saudi ranch, word has it Saudi Arabia is running out of oil. Well, maybe our new drilling tactics can help. Who knows? Homeland Security bigwig Janet Napolitano says the U.S. is at its highest risk for a terror attack since 9-11. And just when we did away with those fabulous color code of warnings. For all you Catholics hoping to take advantage of the confessional app and admit all your wrongdoings via FaceTime on your iPhone, think again. The Vatican says you have to be present in order to be forgiven. Rats. Uh, rumor has it that Apple is manufacturing a new iPad with the same kind of dual camera you get on the iPhone 4, so you might be able to do FaceTime with the iPad. Just a rumor. Uh, but mm, I think it's likely. You rate high on the list for a heart attack and or stroke if you drink a lot of diet soda, so says the latest research study. And Lindsay Lohan claims she is not guilty of ripping off a necklace from a Venice Beach jewelry store, despite surveillance video of her walking out the door with the bobble around her neck. A judge has revoked her probation and set her bail at 40 grand. To be continued. Your San Diego forecast, mostly sunny, highs in the 70s. That's your Thursday morning wake-up call. I'm Andrea Jackson and I'll ring you in the morning. Be good.